I'm Joy Phillips and I'm going to share about what God's doing in South Sudan. At Hanuman Helen Hedug are WGM's first international missionaries and they have been assigned to South Sudan. Four years ago at Hanum was trained in community health evangelism and simply the story or biblical orality. As he was given lessons to teach, um, WGM missionaries continued to mentor him and then as Adhanam became a full trainer, he began mentoring South Sudanese to become trainers as well. And I'd like to share with you what a few of those pastors have um, written about WGM and their interaction with Adhanam. As a person needs to sharpen his spear continuously, what you have been teaching us was like sharpening our spiritual sword. You know Deborah and Jana, another pastor explained, they're not educated ladies, but people get surprised whenever they preach using STS. And Deborah, she's been using CHE very well. She even completed building her toilet. And her husband, even though he's a Muslim, he's allowed her to take the children to church. If Mango Ministries did not come and teach us, do you think we would be like this? It's not possible. Ed Hanum also shared, Yesterday, I had a good time with Canon and Abraham. I thank God that I was able to positively influence them. I'm so moved how they see God working in our friendship. One of the men said, Now we have the knowledge from all of the trainings, all of the assets brought for the training center, and even the borehole. But I'll miss one big thing your presence. At Hanum continued, that is when I began to understand the idea, ministry of presence. God's kingdom is being impacted. It's alive. It's growing. And being here in East Africa and facilitating transformational community development, it is so worth it.